friends. Welcome to Food Fun with Deb. Today we're going to explore, <gasps> whoa, apples, yay. Let's learn about our apple together. Can you say apple? Yes, apple. Great job, friends. Let's spell apple. Apple starts with a, 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 a for apple, a, p, p, l, e, apple, great job, hmm, is this apple purple or red? It's red, boop, boop, <laughs> great job, now, is this apple a square or a circle? A circle, you're right, hooray. All right, it's time to play with our apple. Come on friends, let's go play. The first thing we can do is count the apples falling from the tree. Let's do it together. Oh, I see the apples coming down. One, two, three, four, five. Five apples falling from the tree. Hooray, we counted together. Let's see what apples look like inside. Look, friends, we can make apple stamps. Let's do it together. All right, friends, if we're ready to make our apple stamps, we have to cut our apple in half first. I'm using my super safe knife. Here we go. Back and forth, back and forth. You can make sure that you've got a safe grown up here to help, too. Wow, that was a big jump. Look, we found an apple seed. And we made an apple stem. Great job, friends. What's next? All right, friends, the next thing we have to do to make our apple stamps is stir together our paint. I'm using yogurt for my paint today. I've got my spoon, time to stir. Wow, it's turning purple. You can use whatever paint works for you. I like to make sure it's something that I can taste if I want to. All right, now that my paint is ready to go, it's time to put it on the plate. Here we go. We're stirring the paint onto the We're putting the paint onto the plate. Great job, friends. Now we're ready to do our stamps. All right, we've got our paint and our paper and our apple. We need to push the apple down into the paint before we can make a mark on the paper. Let's do it together. You can use your hands to push the apple into the paint or you can use a fork or one of our little food picks. Let's try a food pick first. Ugh, pushed one in. Look, we have one food pick in and now another one. If we're not ready to hold on to the apple with our hands, we can use our food picks. All right, whoa, we had more of the seeds come out. Hey, I'm ready to squish my apple into the paint. Squish, 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 squish. 
I'm moving it all around to get plenty of paint on my apple. Are we ready? It's time to push the apple stamp onto the paper. Here we go. Stamp, squish, squish, squish. <gasps> we made a mark. We can fill in the leftover part if we need to. I'm gonna try one more time. Here we go. Squish, squish, squish. We did it, friends. <gasps> Whoa. I can move my paint around to finish the apple. Mmm, <gasps> I think I'm going to try my paint. Uh, oh, wow, it's sweet yogurt. Look, we used our apple to stamp onto the paper. Great job, friends, what a fun craft. <gasps> Guess what, once our apple stamp dries, we can add some fun apple extras to it. <gasps> okay, check back when it's dry. We're back. We're ready to add all the fun apple stamp extras to our apple. I'm gonna start with googly eyes for our apple stamp. One, two. <gasps> our apple has one, two eyeballs. Hmm. What else does an apple usually have at the top? I'll give you a hint. It's something that connects it to the apple tree. You guessed right. It's an apple stem. I made an apple stem out of a pipe cleaner. Ta-da! We can add all sorts of extras to our apple stamp art if we want to. You can draw an outline around the stamp. You can add stickers or glitter or sequins. Whatever you want, we can be creative with our apple stamp. All right, friends, my apple's going to go up on my wall now. Welcome to story time. Today we're reading How Do Apples Grow by Jill McDonald, a Hello World book. Let's read. Everyone loves to eat apples, crunch. But do you know how apples grow? There are more than 7,000 types of apples. Apples start from a tiny seed, and if you cut an apple open, you can see the seeds inside. An apple can have up to 10 seeds. <gasps> There's a stem, and the skin of the apple, a leaf, the seeds, and the core of the apple. Apple seeds start to grow when they are planted in soil and given sunlight, water, and fresh air. Did you know that plants use water, light, and air to make their very own food? There they are, planting the apple seeds. The seeds grow roots which reach down, down, down into the soil. This young plant is called a seedling. Hi, Mr. Worm. And a green sprout with tiny leaves shoots up from the ground. When the seedling starts to grow bigger and stronger, it becomes a sapling. It takes two to three years for a seed to become a sapling. The sapling grows taller and becomes a tree. In spring, buds on its branches open into pink and white flowers. Each flower will become an apple. Inside the flower are the parts that make the apple grow. There's the stamen, the pistil, the ovules, and the petal. 
The stamens are covered in yellow pollen, and the pistil has a small sticky tube. Bees fly from flower to flower, spreading pollen from stamens to pistils. <gasps> There's one little bee, bzzz, zip, bzzz, zip, flying from flower to flower. Let's see what happens next. When the apple petals fall, an apple starts to grow. One, two, three, four, five. It takes a full summer for an apple to be ready to eat. Autumn is here. Time for apple picking. Apples can be red, green, or yellow. Look at all those apples. Everyone's having fun picking the apples. Apples are picked, packed, and shipped from the orchard to grocery stores and farmers markets. The apples that fall to the ground, thud, are turned into cider. Apples are delicious, and knowing more about them makes them even sweeter. Apples are full of vitamins to help you grow, too. And look, apples come in so many different forms. You can have apple pie, apple muffins, apple sauce, apple butter, apple cider, apple slices, even just a regular apple. And look, a puppy who's so excited to be there. Now you know how apples grow. Good things are worth waiting for. The end. Thanks for reading today with me, friends. I'll see you later. Bye. Peekaboo! These apples were pretending to be my eyes. <laughs> That's so silly. Let's look. Red. Round. This apple is smooth. Wow. Boop, boop, boop. I heard it. Let's play peekaboo together. You see the apple? Here it is. Oh no. Oh no! Where did our apple go? There's our apple. It was hiding under the cup. Let's do it again. Oh no! Where did our apple go? Is it up in the sky? No. Is the apple down on the ground? No, it's not there either. The apple is under the cup. Peekaboo apple, we found you. Hooray! Oh, nose. Smelling. Smelling flowers. Ah. Doggy smell. <laughs> Sneezing. Huh? Huh? Ah, uh, achoo! <laughs> wow. Let's do it again. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. What comes next? Ah, uh, choo! Great job, friends. We sneeze the apple up our nose. So fun. Oh, let's learn about it with our lips. Happy, happy. Our mouth is happy. 
and our smile is happy. Uh oh. Oh no. Our apple is sad and our face is sad. We made frowny faces. Sad, sad. Wait a minute. Are we sad or are we? Happy! We're happy because we're playing together. Yeah, happy. Hi, friend. Oh, I pretended that it was my mouse talking, but it was the apple. <laughs> Let's do it again. Hi, friend. Hmm. Push against my lips. Sweet apple. <laughs> Let's try again. I love apples. <gasps> I licked my lips again. <gasps> oh. A uh, tongue. Tongues lick ice cream. Tongues lick apples. Do it one more time. Tongue out. Uh, uh, I see your tongue. Here we go. Uh, wow, sweet. Teeth. Let's use our teeth to explore the apples. Here we go. I'm going to make bite mark in my apple. Let's do it. And crunch. <gasps> wow, we made a bite mark. <gasps> Great job, friend. I'm ready to chew, chew, chew the apple down. <gasps> Come join me. Here I go. My teeth are ready. Uh, crunch. I crunched a piece off. Wow. Okay, time to chew, chew, chew. Here we go. Chew, chew, chew. Look, here it is. Uh, <laughs> time to swallow. All gone. It went down, down, down. Hooray, friends! We played with the apple today. Thank you so much. Cool. Have some apple, friend. Even dogs like apples, too. Friends, we're going to make apple donuts. Hooray! I'm so excited to do this with you. Come check it out. All right, here's what we'll need to make our apple donuts. First, we need our apple donut. Then, we need something to spread our frosting on with. After that, we'll add toppings and sprinkles. Are we ready? Let's do it. I'm going to take some of my frosting and spread it onto the apple donut. Here we go. For spreading today, I'm using a popsicle stick, but you can use anything that you have that will let you spread safely. Spreading around, around and around. I think I put a lot of frosting on, but that's okay. I can lick it off. Mmm. This frosting is blackberry yogurt. It's sweet when I lick it. Okay, we've spread our frosting. Now it's time to add our toppings. <gasps> Let's count together. I'm using blueberries for my toppings today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
seven. We use seven blueberries to decorate our apple donut. Hooray! Who's ready to add sprinkles? <gasps> Me too! Okay, these sprinkles are little and black, and the ones I'm using today are called chia seeds, but you can use any sprinkles you have at home. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna use my pincer fingers to pinch up some sprinkles and spread them onto the apple donut. Get your fingers ready. Here I go. Picking up. Sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. I think I want some more sprinkles. Let's do it again. Sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. And a little bit more. Wow, friends. We added so many sprinkles along with our blueberries and our frosting. Wow! Let's take a closer look. Look at our amazing apple donut that we made. First we had our donut, then we spread on our frosting, added all of our toppings, and sprinkled on some fun sprinkles. All right, friends, I'm ready to try the apple donut. Here I go. First I'll do a lick. Eh, I got some of the frosting off. Okay, time for a big dinosaur bite. <gasps> I made a mark. Mmm. When I tried the apple donut, it was crunchy and sweet and creamy all together. What does your apple donut taste like? Friends, thank you so much for playing with apples with me today. I had a lot of fun. Do you remember when we made apple stamp monsters? Me too! What about when Cooper ate the apple? <laughs> he really liked apples, huh? I had so much fun reading the apple book with you. And then we made the apple donut. <laughs> that was really fun too. What was your favorite part? Oh, oh I like that one as well. Hmm, how do you think you're gonna try apples next? Oh, I like that idea. I can't wait to hear all about it. All right, friends. I think there's only one thing left to do. It's time to say goodbye. I've got my apple and I've got my chef's hat. Okay, let's say goodbye to the apple so it can go back into its home. Goodbye, apple. Goodbye, apple. Goodbye, apple, until we play again. <gasps> Should we sing the song to each other now? Okay. <gasps> Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends, until we play again. Thanks, everyone. Bye.